With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Okay, so the given question here we have is the general solution of the equation tan 3x is equal to what? tan 5x is. We have to find the general solution for this equation here I have. Okay, so first of all, this is my solution part here. Okay, it says that tan 3x equals to what? tan 5x. Okay, so first of all, we know that when my tan theta is equal to what? tan of alpha, right? So in that case, what is my general solution? My general solution comes out as in case of tan n pi plus alpha, right? You guys know about it, n pi plus alpha. So here it is given to me that my tan of what 3x is equals what tan of 5x. So in that case, if I consider here theta is what my 3x and alpha is what my 5x. So this will become what from this the solution we are going to receive is basically come out as what my 3x is equals what n pi right n pi plus 5x. Okay. So in that case, I can or uh, this will become what x value will become my basically x value will be two times of x equals what minus of n pi. Right. If I put this n pi on the LHS side and this 3x to the RHS side, this will be what positive of 2x and this is what negative of minus n pi. So this will become from this my x belongs to minus n pi by. So now as my x belongs to what minus of n pi by 2 range, or we can say that then the solution of x is what minus of n pi by 2. Where what is my x? Sorry, what is my n? N would be what integer. Right. N will be integer. So if I put the value as there is a minus here, so if I put a negative value here, so this value will become what positive. And if I put a positive value, this value will be what negative. So in that case, I can say that generally, I can say that what my x value will be. X will be what n pi by 2. Right. For where my n is what n belongs to my integer. Right. Because this integer value will give me what all negative and positive values, and for zero it will give me the zero value. So the solution is what general solution which will come out as what x equals to n pi by two where n belongs to what z integer I can say here. So which option is correct? Exactly my option number one is the correct option we are looking for. X belongs to n pi by two and n belongs to what z. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.